friends now let us discuss about clamper circuits in the diode circuits topic so clamper circuit is a, a is a circuit which will restore the dc value of a ac waveform so when you consider input waveform here so without any distortion the same input will be will get it output without any distortion but the only difference is the dc value of input waveform will be changed to the positive or negative normally when you take uh, sinusoidal waveforms so here in the sinusoidal waveform uh, this is the input waveform here the dc value is zero but here when you want to change the dc value to the positive or negative accordingly we use the clamper circuit so clamper circuits are classified as positive clamper as well as negative clamper positive clamper means the value will be clipped to the positive and negative clamper means the dc value will be uh, clamped to the negative value of dc here okay so now let us see the positive clamper now in the positive clamper we will use a diode circuit which use diode capacitor and resistor it is same as a it is same as a half wire rectifier only but only difference is in half wire rectifier normally this diode will keep here and the capacitor will keep it output we will take the output across the capacitor we will take output across the capacitor but now in this clamper circuit we will take the diode we will take the output across the diode that is the only difference so here to analyze the circuit uh, the first step we have to do is the first step is see the maximum voltage to which the capacitor will get charged so here the capacitor will get charged when it is conducting when the diode is conducting because when the diode is conducting this resistance will be zero uh, so r will be negligible so this is zero and c so rc is zero actually so when rc is zero capacitor will charge instantly to that voltage so here we have to see when the diode is conducting so according to the polarity so according to the polarity here so uh, this negative polarity is connected to the source so when the when you get negative half cycle then diode will conduct so if you observe during the positive half cycle during the positive half cycle the diode will be in off condition when the diode is in off condition input will be equal to output but when it comes to the negative half during the negative half diode will conduct so when the diode is conducting capacitor will charge instantly to that voltage value so here capacitor voltage value will, let us take this is the vc so this vc will be equal to this vc will be equal to so here the maximum peak is minus vm so it will be charged to minus vm that is the voltage at capacitor now first you have to see the maximum value of capacitor is the first step then the second step is now when the diode is open circuit what is the output voltage here so when the because in the, in the third class cycle onwards here the voltage is minus vm so obviously the diode will be in the reverse bias condition only so from third clock cycle onwards the output will be only this vi and vc so next we need to find out what is the v not here so if you take a loop equation like this i'm taking in this way so vi minus vc minus v not equal to 0 this is the output voltage so here v not will be equal to vi minus vc but here the capacitor voltage will be equal to minus vm because normally when you are doing the clamper circuits the condition we follow is always the rc that is this resistance as well as rc should be more than more than 10 times of the the time period of input waveform so here we will take maximum rc so it takes time to discharge the capacitor so capacitor will hold this value for a long time so here capacitor value is minus vm so v naught is equal to vi plus vm this is the output voltage so if you take this is the input waveform so when input is zero the output is equal to vm so this is how the input when input is zero output is vm when input is vm then output will go to 2 vm again when input is zero here then output is equal to vm again when input is minus vm then output will go to zero so here if you observe the circuit this is the how output waveform will look like so replica of input so this is how we will get the output so here this is the vm level so if you observe the circuit the input is in dotted line but output you will get and this is solid line is output so this output is the dc value change to plus vm here the dc value change to plus vm so according to this output we will get vm plus this input voltage so this is the output waveform so here it is clipped to the positive value of vm that is peak value here 
So, the peak value at this point is 2 Vm. So, if you observe another, another one, so the peak to peak is only 2 Vm here also, the peak to peak is 2 Vm as well as for input also the peak to peak is 2 Vm for the input as well as for output waveform also. So, both are same, uh, both are same waveforms but the difference is the only DC value has been changed. So, this is the positive clamper circuit.